with some more Undertale. Because this game is fucking awesome. That's all that needs to be said about this game. So let's just continue where I left off after meeting Sans and his brother. Ah! Fishing pole! Let's go fishing. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. Yes! All that, uh, uh, all that's attached to it at the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me! Here's my number! <laughs> you decide not to call. Why not? Can I grab it or something? <laughs> yeah, I really miss... You know, go mommy. I got no mommy to call. Let's see. Let's look at this. Is a box. Thank you. I wouldn't notice that. Put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Use the box? Yes. Butter scotch pie. Ah, it's a tough glove. Why not? Or maybe I need to put it all in, in case somebody steals my stuff. Who knows? A snow drake flutters forth! And uh, maybe it likes... Let's heckle it. You tell the snow drake that they aren't funny. Is your flesh rotten as you? Ow! I'm so good at dodging. Snow Drake realized that his own name is a pun and is freaking out! <laughs> Joke. Make a bad ice pun. Is that supposed to be funny? Yeah? It's practicing its next pun. Let's laugh at it. You laugh at Snow Drake before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? I don't know. Ah! Fuck! Snowdrake is smiling at its own bad joke. Uh, let's see. Maybe heckle it some more. You boo the Snowdrake! This won't be funny either! Mm -hmm. Snowdrake is smiling at its own bad joke. Let's heckle it some more! Tell the snow drake that no one will love them the way they are. Oh, they struggle to make a retort and slink away, utterly crushed. <laughs> I want them cold. Okay, there's the two brothers. So, as I was saying about Undyne. Yes! Why don't you take a picture? It will last longer. Look at them spinning. Stop! Oh my god! Is that a human? Um. Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. <laughs> oh, hey. What's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 Ahem! Human! You shall not pass this area! Who are you, Gandalf? I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you! I will then capture you! Oh, you will be delivered to the capital! Then! Then! I'm not sure what's next. <laughs> In any case... Continue only if you dare. Yeah. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Thank you, Sans. <laughs> I know the bet. Ice cap struts into view. Let's see. Compliment. You inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. It does. Envious? Too bad. Oh! Fuck you! It's a snowing dandruff. Ugh. Steal the hat! I want the hat! But it's not wicked enough. Help! Fashion police! Man, this is awesome! 
I want the hat. What a great hat. Mine. Ah! It succeeded! It melts in my hands. What can I say? This cap is no more. Mercy. But I didn't get the hat! I wanted the hat! There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. I wonder whose sentry station this could be. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was the very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Let's see... Absolutely no moving. That would be kind of boring. <gasps> Mr. Dog, did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo <laughs> blocks the way. Doggo, pet. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Let's see... Will it move this time? Doggo can't seem to find anything. Let's see... Will it move this time? Seems that it works when I don't move. Let's see... Pet? You pet dog! Oh look! He's a happy doggy! What? I've been pet! Pet? Pot? Pot? Pet? Pot? 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 <laughs> Doggo has been pet! No. Oh! He's um... Yellow now, so I can spare him! You won! You earn! 0 XP and 30 gold! S something pet me! Something that isn't moving! I'm gonna need some dog treats for this! That's so adorable! <laughs> tick tick! Hello? Is anybody there? No? Let's give it some dog treats. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Who the hell does that? Maybe Doggo does it. Ah, hello, Sans. Hey, here's something important to remember. Our brother has a very special attack. See a blue attack, don't move, and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Thanks, buddy. Ah, I'm sliding on the ice! So, let's see if I can get down to the sign. North ice, south ice, west ice, east snowed in town, and ice. Let's just check up north first. Lesser dog appears. <coughs> I wonder what I'm gonna go with here. Should I pet him or pet him? Or maybe pet would be more efficient. Let's go with this one. You barely lifted your hand, and lesser dog get excited. Man, 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 man. Ah! <laughs> Mr. Dog is barking excitedly. No, I can mercy it now. Spear! You won! And I got no gold. A snowman! Do you want to build a snowman? Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Yes! Thank you! Good luck! You got the snowman piece. Today I'm gonna help a snowman and take him to the ends of Earth. You're so lazy! Oh, this music is so fucking cool! You're napping all night! I think that's called sleeping. Excuses! Excuses! 
Oh, the human arrives in order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. Challenge accepted. I think you will find this one quite shocking. Does it involve electricity of some sort? For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze! When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty sap. Sound like fun? Actually, it does. Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. <laughs> okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> he got sapped instead. Saws, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Thank you for showing me the way through. Hold this, please. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the light on my head. This game is fucking awesome! Incredible, you slippery snail! Oh, you reminded me about Goat Mommy. And then I killed her. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, <laughs> The next puzzle will not be easy. It is decided by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. Yeah! <laughs> and he did just moonwalk out of there? That was kinda cool. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. Yeah, he does. By the way, did you see the weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man. Isn't my brother cool? Mm, okay. <laughs> if you think so. Oh, that looks like a cool dude. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh! A customer! He looks so happy! Hello, would you like some nice cream? Uh, it's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Okay, I'll buy one. Here we go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Okay, what's this? Oh, it's a football! Yes! Oh, I'm gonna dribble it! Oh! Fuck yeah, come with me, buddy! Oh yes! We're off on an adventure! And I think you need to go into the hole. No! It's becoming smaller! No! No, I'm sorry! Don't, don't go away! Ah! It's going away! No! I need to get it down there quickly. Oh, it's been so long since I played soccer. Ah! Fuck it. Ah! Come on! Into the hole with you. Yes! I, I got a green flag. Green, your concern and care for ball led you to a delicious victory. Yes! And I got 1G. Can I... Push this one? No. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow deck I hit from. Okay. Human! I hope you're ready for. Subs! Where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Okay. Sans, the human is escaping! You made the puzzle too hard! Hey you! Get back here! Okay. I'll look at it. Monster skins weren't searched? <laughs> this is fucking awesome! I love this game! <laughs> oh. Am I supposed to... Fall? Sans, that didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? Can't believe you said that! In my opinion, 
Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. This game! I love this game so much! What? Really? Dude? That easy piece of word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. You mod! Solve this dispute. Which is the harder? Crossword? <laughs> I mean, you two are weird! Crosswords are so easy! It's the same solution every time! I just fill all in the boxes with the letters. <laughs> because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yeah! <laughs> Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday he got some trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> This game is fucking awesome. It's a note from Papyrus. You mod, please enjoy the spaghetti. Why, thank you. Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap. Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. Yeah! Papyrus. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti. Oh, This game. I love it so much. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. That's one hell of a microwave. Hi, mouse! I'm not gonna stop tickling you! Okay. Enough tickling. <laughs> Warning! Dog marriage? I'm not sure what to think of that. It's probably... No. Here, ah! Boss fight. Ice Cap appears and Jerry came to! Hi, Jerry! Du, du, du. See, Jerry... Ditch! You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. Your head looks so... Naked. Ah, oh yeah, this. It, it was this guy. Everyone, I need to fight it! Eh. Where's your hat? Ah! I forgot that it does a thing. Let's steal... No. Okay, let's try stealing it. Succeeded, it, it melts in your hands. Who doesn't know? Fuck off, Jerry! So, like, what are you even doing? Return of Jerry. Jerry, ditch! Yes! I ditched Jerry! Fuck you, Jerry. Nobody likes you. Is this where the dog marriage is? Woo! What's this? Oh. Is it a present? Is it amazing? Ah! Think this is. Yeah. So I need to check this up here. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click! <gasps> and a battle! Jerry! I don't want to play with you. Or maybe we, I should um, fight the ice cap first. So I can steal his hat. It looks so naked. I mean, the combat system in, in, in this game is just so... Uh, it's not like anything I've ever seen before. Awkward. <laughs> Jerry tells everyone it has to go to the bathroom. <laughs> You won! <gasps> oh. This game... It's hilarious. Let's see. Eh. Is this the dog marriage? What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify yourself! <laughs> Hmm, here's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate! 
Eliminate you! Doggy assault you! Yeah, those are going kissy kissy. That, that, that's kinda cute. Act. Dogaressa. Pet! The Dogaressa is too suspicious of your smell. Stop, don't touch her. Beware of dog. No! Stop! I. I. Ugh! Dogs are re re evaluating your smell. The gamey. Re sniff. Dog sniff you again. But you smell just as weird as before. Uh, okay. Smell mystery. Ah, oh, fuck you guys! How the hell am I supposed to get away from that? Saying sickly sweet things to each other. Ugh, oogie. Roll around! Maybe change my smell. You roll around in dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Don't touch my hot dog. He beats me. No! Get away! Dogs may want to re-smell you. Re-sniff! Dogs sniff you again. After rolling in, in the dirt, you smell alright! Hmm, smells like... Actually, are you actually a, a little puppy? Yes, I am! Ah, oh, leave me alone! You bastards. Mercy! Take my wife, it's fleas. <laughs> my wife's fleas. No! I'm so fucked, aren't I? Oh, I died! Damn it! Ah! Cannot give up just yet. Meta, stay determined. I will. I'm gonna beat this goddamn game. I'm gonna do it. Switch was up here. Ah. Oh, Jerry! Stop that! It looks so naked. Shh, I'm thinking, guys. Mercy. Awkward. Bye, Jerry. Poor Jerry. Nobody likes him. <laughs> Let's try this dog thing again. Try roll. Oh, did didn't? Oh no, I didn't press the switch. It was the battle thingy. Pfft. Yeah, click. There we go. Time to try out the dog marriage thing again. Hmm. This better work. But, but the music in, in this game is really cool. It's, you know, varied. No. No eliminating, please. Roll around! Smell like a weird puppy. Let's kick human tail. Ah! <laughs> Dogs may want to re-smell you. Dogaressa, re-sniff. Dogs sniff you again. After rolling in, in the dirt, you smell alright. What? It smells like a... Are you actually a, a little puppy? Ah, oh, there we go! That's how to get away from... Thanks, uh, random Twitch streamer, Taya Taco Bomber. Thank you. Let's see. Act. Amy. Resniff. Smell just fine. Let's see. Let's see. Merce. Uh. Maybe pet? You pet the dog, Aressa. What about me? A dog that pets dogs! Amazing! No! Ah, 
I don't want your love! Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I need to pet the other dog. Pet dog Amy. Wow! Pet by another pup! Dog's minds have been expanded. Yay! You won! Did it! Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. You're welcome. Okay, what kind of puzzle is this? Turn every X into an O and press the switch. Ah! See if I can get this right. Ah, there's Mr. Buddy. Ah, I stepped on it too much. So. There we go. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? The spaghetti? <laughs> what do you tell us Papyrus about his spaghetti? Uh, I left it? Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Mm-hmm. Because I'm so nice. Don't you know? Fret not, human! I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want! <laughs> wow, isn't that nice of you? My brother started a sock collection recently. You better not have taken any of Goat Mommy's socks or I'm gonna fuck you up. How sanding. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah! <laughs> Human! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Maybe I should arrange your face to look more like the snow. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. Suppose what I'm saying is, wait a human! Human, I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed! Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. Try not to give away the answers. Yes, please. I hate spoilers. Yeah. Okay. There's probably... Mmm... I think this all depends on where I enter the area from. But that tricky part is the column right underneath. But I don't see how I can get the X that's between the two rocks there. The second one from the top. I guess I just have to try this a few times. Uh, where to start? Let's just see what happens when I do it like this. And, and yeah, that's the one that I can't get a hold of. No. How am I supposed to get... Ugh. Ah! No circles, triangles for all! I probably have to walk in a very specific way. Ah! 
I get it, I get it, I get it. Of course. I love puzzle. Wow, you saw it! Of course I did! And you did it all without my help. Incredible! I'm impressed! This is nothing compared to Professor Layton puzzles. You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah! <laughs> Man, he's a speedy skeleton. Like skeleton. Hello, Sans. Good job of solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. <laughs> You're still alright. I love this music! Hey! It's the human! I don't love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Yeah. Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are all electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. Nice! They will make you smell delicious! Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like. But, if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you! Okay. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also sap you! Purple tiles are slippery. It will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons! Which piranhas do they not like? Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Uh, understand? Understand the explanation? Yeah. Great, then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Yeah! Get ready. Okay, now I'm curious. Oh, pink! <laughs> I called it! I called it! <laughs> I just spun out! <laughs> I knew it! That was awesome! Actually, that's spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. The machine isn't working. Yes. <gasps> it's a kitty cat! Hello, kitty cat! No! Oh, it looked like a kitty cat, but now I see it's a husky thing. This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. Let's save it. Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, he fills you with DETERMINATION! Where of dog? Please pet dog. I want to pet it. I want to pet the dog. On the floor inside is a box of pom pomeraisins. That's a cow! A dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't ever know what to create. This probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. And you're a ballerina cow or something? And we have another puzzle there. Ah! It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it, in red marker. How do you write on snow with red marker? That doesn't seem very, you know. Oh, this is gonna be awesome! No, I fell off. I wasn't okay. Probably need to do it like this. Oh, fuck! This is not the way. 
Because then that's going to turn into... Yeah. But I can try checking out different things. <clears throat> okay, I think I have the solution now. I start down here. And I go up there. And there. And like this. Ah, uh -huh, yeah. No! <laughs> I missed it! Oh, I didn't go far, far enough up. Oh, well, this time. Third time's the charm. But I saw the solution pretty early there. Really? I need to not stand on the edge? Fine. If you're gonna be like that. Stand in the middle. There we go! Yay! Magical bridge! Let's continue. I'm sliding and sliding. <laughs> I had snow on my head. That's down here. Oh, maybe I should check out this area first. <gasps> it's a little dog house! Woof! Oh, hello puppy! Are you inside? What a tiny dog house! Is that the puppy? Yes it is! Are you a dangerous puppy that's gonna bite my head off while you yap so cute? Oh! <laughs> it's the greater dog! <laughs> play! Greater dog is not excited enough to play with. Ah. Greater dog is waiting for your command. <laughs> Back in! Call the greater dog! Bounce towards you, flicking slobber into your face! <sighs> Maybe it's when it's blue that I... Does it spear have a face too? It certainly looks like it. So... Pet! Greater dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Mm. Then it wakes up. It's so excited! Bark, bark! Bark, bark! <laughs> I love this! Let's see. Play! Make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Great, the dog picks up all the snow in the air and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. He rests its head on you. No. Ugh, how to it? Want some TLC? Mm. So you pet the dog, it sinks in its entire weight into you. Oh, your movement's slow. But you still haven't pet enough. Mm. Eh. Oh, what did I do? Pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. Dog flops over with its leg hanging in the air. <sighs> Great dog is contented. Mercy! Yes! 40 gold! Oh, so adorable. <laughs> Just look at it. That's so freaking cute. I love this game. Down here, where's Sans? <gasps> Your eyes watching me. Give Trot confront you! Decorate! You had some googly eyes you found on the ground. Gosh darn teenage googly eyes! Give Trot stumbles blindly! Gift! Gift Trot refuses your gift. Oh, no, no, it's not a trick! 
Well, more googly eyes for you. Nah, fuck it. Decorate, you can't improve on perfection. <laughs> Gosh darn teenage googly eyes. Did no fuck. Let's try that again. You're going to be alright. Meta, stay determined. Okay. Oh fuck, I didn't say. This time I'm not gonna fuck up this puzzle. And I'm gonna go back and save after doing it. Just in case. Yes! Time to save! Again! Yeah. And maybe I'll go down now and see what Sans wanted to say. Oh, I have to... Fuck it! Let's see. Why not? There we go! I'm just streaming along! With my awesome snow top hat. Let's go down and see what Bones wants. What's up? Nothing much. Just looking at the sinister eyes. Uh, are you lost? And it's the Grift Rot again! Decorate! He has the googly eyes you found on the ground. And gosh darn teenage googly eyes. Grift Rot stumbles blindly. Let's see. Let's fight it a little bit. Get this off me! May may maybe I need to be nice. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, let's be nice. Undecorate. Remove the googly eyes. Thanks for nothing. You're mean. Gift that eyes you with suspicion. Gift. No! I'll do the googly eyes again. You're warned. Ah, oh, fuck it. Ah, what did I s What happened? The scent of fresh pine needles. I'm gonna decorate you again! Gosh, our teenage googly eyes! Ah, I'm dead. He from stumbles blindly. Let's play. Escaped! Should just done that. Oh, look at the view. Look at the cottage down there. <gasps> There's sparkles here. Nice little sparkles. It's a door. I see that. <gasps> this is fun. Let's turn off the lights. Makes a mood. Hello, sparkles. The door. So I'm not supposed to go here, is that it? Maybe something for later. Say, are you following me? Yeah. I guess I can't do anything with door as it is now. So let's go back and heal up and let's find the doggy again. Because I can. Music is so awesome in this game. It's just yes. And it's gonna be fun fighting the puppy again. She's waggly cute tail and it's barking and she's so excited. 
It's just so... <laughs> how it rises from the snow like that. It's awesome. It's a greater dog! Beckon! Come on! Fucking slobber. How am I supposed to avoid that? Let's see. Pet! There. Ah! Ah! They hit me all three times. Of course, let's play. Let's play, doggy! Ah! Want some TLC? Let's pet it again. But you still haven't pet enough! Stop! I'm gonna die, aren't I? Dog flops over with his leg hanging in the air. Fuck! Ah, oh, I'm still alive! Yay! I survived just barely! Man, you're one fearsome opponent, greater dog. So great that your tail's gonna stick out of the armor. Is there a save point up at... I'm not gonna take any chances. Because I hate... You know, having to do these fights again. I had a castle on my head this time! That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, this is so awesome. No! Oh, I kinda thought I was gonna sail over the end there. Okay, what's on my head this time, I wonder? A cowboy hat thingy. Let's see here. Ah, this bridge looks nice and totally not about to fall together. So. Oh, this is the best song ever! Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror! Okay! It's the it's a doggy! <laughs> a fearsome doggy! When I say the word, it will fully activate! Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice, each part will swing violently up and down, and the doggy shall bark in the night. Only the tiniest chance of victory will chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That, um, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, maybe, too easy to defeat the human with. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we can use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No glass at all. And away it goes. <laughs> Phew. Papyrus, you're one glorious bastard. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah! <laughs> huh? Mm hmm. <laughs> awesome. I don't want to know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Maybe that's what I did wrong with them, um, you know. Then you just stand still when they're blue. Ugh. Welcome to Snowden! It's a flower! Fuck you, flower! Mm. Welcome to Snowden Town. <laughs> it's a shop! Hello, Mrs. Bunny. Bye. Manly Bandana. Eat it twice. Cinnamon bun is my own recipe. 
I actually have lots of stuff. Bicycle. Yeah, why not? Hello, traveler. Talk! Say hello! Hiya! Welcome to Snowden! I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? Capital? You don't look like a tourist. Really? Because this place seems like the perfect place to be a tourist, you know? It just seems so nice. What to do here? Want to know what to do here in Snowden? Grillbees has food and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. <laughs> yeah, there's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more in interesting since then. I don't doubt that. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fussy folk decided to like the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages. So unless you're a ghost or can borrow a barrel under the door, forget about it. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Yeah. Let's exit and um, equip the, the new stuff. Item. Nice cream. <laughs> Tough glove. Use equip tough glove and the manly bandana. I can't even see it. Ah, oh, there is the box. Let's put the nice cream in there. And I got a stick. Let's put the snowman piece there too. Okay. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. That's good. Uh, let's check out the inn. Oh, that's a nice bunny lady. Welcome to Snowed Inn. Snowed Inn's premier hotel. Well, night is 80G. I don't have that much cash. Well, feel free to come back anytime. Oh, hello there. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. Oh! <gasps> I need to go and be nice to monsters and earn gold. What's maximum HP? You'll learn when you're older. There's lots of bunnies here. You want to walk to the other side of the town? Try the undersnow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. Let's just talk with these bunnies. A lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. You mean the, the lady walking her smaller bunny? Is, is that her kid? Does she have her kid on a harness or something? Is my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee and hello, Mr. Bear. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree-like horns. <laughs> oh, really? I know nothing about that. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tra tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Hmm. It seems like this human holiday we have, which is called Xmas or something. Yo, you're a kid too, right? Mm-hmm. can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Yeah. No adults wear striped clothing ever. Groobies. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That seems like a decent way to solve your problems. That's politics! Let's check out Grillby's. This is the cool part of town with all the people I've run into so far. 
No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and... Hot guys! <laughs> That's so desperate made a call if I ever heard one. Um, isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> That's an awesome monster, and that's the coolest horse ever. The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm, I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slayer slip into their slip onto their butt. The jukebox is broken. Oh, well, that's fine. This music is awesome. Hello, doggies. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. I love bones. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You better watch where you go sit down here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. Ah, oh, doggies. Hello, doggies. I'm thinking of getting a spike collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, Attach a lease to me and take me for a walk, please. <laughs> Hello, Dougie! It's it's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Okay. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undine. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Mr. Hothead. Grilbs said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but it doesn't touch the stuff. <laughs> what do you mean I can't get a whiskey or something here? Come on! Give me a whiskey. Oh, okay. Oh, it's a Doctor Who mouse. Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. During this crowding lack of sunlight, I would join them. They're just so very funny. And you, Mr. Hordies. We all know that the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? Point? A library! Yes! <gasps> Hello! Are you a badger? Welcome to the library. Yes, we know, the sign is misspelled. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. That's my kind of newspaper! See? <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Good for you. Now look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? Um, I'm not the best at crosswords. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made out of. Really? What are human souls made out of? But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need those things to exist. Okay. Monster History Part 4. Ah, I should probably read from the left. I'm not gonna... La 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 la. To reach what we know, call our capital U home. Again, our king is really bad at names. <laughs> it's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. Funerals, we take the dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. And their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. <laughs> that's that's kind of fun way. Our monsters are mostly made of magic. Human beings are mostly made of water. 
Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. I'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I'm still writing that one. <laughs> because they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are tuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their, their attacks will hurt us. Oh. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill... Um, let's end the chapter here. Oh. I'm still thinking about Goat Mommy and how I killed her. Oh my god. So evil. That's one full mailbox. Unread junk mail. What about the other one? This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Look inside. Yes! It's empty. Aw. This house is so nice. It's locked. Is this where Sans and Papyrus live then? It's locked from the inside. And there, there was this path leading up, wasn't it? Let's check that out before we continue eastward. Why the hell am I tired? I mean, it's late per, you know, Norwegian time. Let's play Monsters and Humans! He said a blob ought to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Knock knock! Oh, what a beautiful knock! Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Okay! My patience rewards me. Okay. You're not gonna o open the door, are you? Okay. Let's check up north. I'm looking at the ocean. Nothingness fills my soul. Oh, whatever. <laughs> what are you doing? Ah! Oh, I want to float on those. I guess I have to go down. And continue eastwards. Just looks so nice. Oh yeah, those there are those icebergs. Is it becoming colder? Yep. Eh. I can't see. It's freaking cold. I wonder who that could be. Human. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you're cool. These feelings, it must be what you are feeling right now. Sure. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, a great papyrus, will be your... My what? No. No. No, this is all wrong! I can't be your friend! You are a human! I must capture you! Search your feelings, Papyrus. You know it will be true. We were meant to be friends and eat pasta and solve puzzles until the end of time. Then I can fulf fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. Newest member of the Royal Guard. Gotta watch out for blue attacks, I guess. Pyrrhus, flirt! What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Oh yes, I've always liked bony guys like you. Well, I was skilled with very high standards. I can make spaghetti! 
Oh, no! You're meeting all my standards! <laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. <laughs> Let's date later, after I capture you. Okay? Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Papyrus. <laughs> Flirt and ho! Oh, let's date later, after I capture you. Okay? Papyrus is thinking about what to cook for his date. Let's insult him and see what happens. Oh. How selfless. You want me to feel better about fighting you. I don't deserve such hospitality from you. Okay! The pair stabs a bone claw <laughs> behind his ear. Uh. Likes to say, yeah. <laughs> I kinda knew that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, do I have to attack him or something? Damn smearing the hair sauce behind his ear. <laughs> Ooh, that's the perfect scent to bring on a date. No, so he won't fight. Then, let's see if he can handle my fable blue attack. Oh yeah. I know what to do. What is that? You're blue now. That's my attack. Yeah. I, I fall down. You're blue now. Oh, the music picked up. Flirt. Fierce is too busy fighting to flirt back. Let's date later after I capture you. Ah! So I need to. Ah, oh, fuck you, Papyrus. This music is so awesome. Mid red anime powder behind his hair. Uh, set- oh, sorry. Oh. Think about that date thing. Ah! Fuck you, Papyrus! Ah! Oh! Ow! Ah! Oh! 21. Hold up longer for jump higher. Jeez! I kind of figured that out. Dish back. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Ah! Da, da, fuck! <laughs> this is so fun! <laughs> oh, but I kinda suck at it. I can also almost taste my future popularity. Ah! Okay, jump a little bit before and stand still through that one. Ah, oh, fuck it. The royal god! Oh man! <laughs> Fuck you, Papyrus! Smells like bones! Papyrus, a pearl and spaghetti! Ah! Oh! Oh, fuck it. I probably need to heal up. Bandage. You need one half of the biscuit. You recovered 11 HP. Undyne will be really proud of me. You sure? Ah! No! Oh! Fuck! Ah! Pierce is trying hard to play it cool. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of a smile. Oh, fuck it. Preparing a bone attack. Uh, I'm... Let's heal up a bit. Brother will... Well, it won't change very much. This is the coolest RPG ever. I have lots of admirers, but... Uh, what? 
Nothing but about it, mister. Ah! Too slow! Considering his options. Okay, he's halfway down. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? Not if you keep bugging them like this. Oh! Oh my god! This is... Oh, the Pierce is cackling. Fuck you. Combat system is so awesome! Someone like you is really rare. I mean... Has anybody ever made a game with a combat engine like this before? I've never noticed it, at least. Let's see. Let's try the Cinnabon. Oh, maxed out. And dating might be kind of hard. No! I need to stand absolutely still. I can't be jumping. Forty-three. After you captured and sent away. Ah! This is so fucking awesome. Okay, or who cares? Give up. No, I'm never giving up. Ah! Bob. Mm. <laughs> Trying hard to play it cool. 47! Give up or face my special attack! Ah! Ah! Fuck it. Uh, can I... Can I flirt with him now? Or maybe I should... Yeah. Oh, fuck it. Very soon I'll use my special attack! This is so awesome! This is trying hard to play cool. Behold, my special attack! Will it be blue? What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. It's getting for a regular attack. Ugh, can I do something? Oh, fuck it. Here's an absolute thing. Yeah. Ah! Fuck you! Papyrus, ah! Stop that! Ah! No! Cool! Dude. I can fly now! <laughs> I have two health left. Okay? <laughs> well, Huff Huff, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore I, the Great Papyrus, like to grant you pity. I will spare you, human! Now is your chance to accept my mercy. Spare... sparing you? Uh, can I... Uh, mercy spare? Yeah. I'm... 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 I'm sparing you! No! Can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the royal god. And my friend quantity will remain stagnant! What should I say? Let's be friends! Really? You want to be friends with me? Yeah, sure, why not? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie, we haven't even had our first date! And I've already managed to hit the friend zone! <laughs> oh, you knew that all I needed uh, to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them! Sounds like the best way to make friends ever. Taught me a lot, human. 
I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Is that someone me? Maybe, maybe. Like you! Ah, oh, I knew it! That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. So if I leave this place, I'll let the monsters out? Okay. And those monsters can return to the surface. I knew it! I knew it! Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. King of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fussy pushover. <laughs> Everybody loves the guy. I'm certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. But what about Rash Goro, whatever? <laughs> and Mommy called that guy. Oh, I was thinking about a code Mommy again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. You got it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? The? Was he running up the trees? Okay, time to heal up. Or. Maybe I should just continue on onwards. Maybe use an item. Uh, let's use this. Cinnamon. You eat the cinnamon, cinnamon bunny. There we go. This seems ominous. Yo! Are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome! She's the coolest, right? Sure, I have no idea who you're talking about, but I'm sure she's a lovely lady. I'm gonna be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Haha. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Smiley! This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many le legally required breaks. I'm going to grill these. Wanna come? Yeah! I'm quite sure. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Let's go to Grillby's. Over here. I know a shortcut. Thank you, buddy. Fast shortcut, huh? Mm-hmm. Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hi, Sansie. Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? <laughs> nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. Which means he's really hungry now. I mean, 30 minutes without food. He must be thinking of brunch. Tss. Here, get comfy. Pfft, whoopee cushions. Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes we're just put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? I can never turn down meat. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Ruby, we'll have a double order of Berg. So, what do you think of my brother? He is cool! I gotta uh, admit that. And sometime we'll go on a date. Mm -hmm. Of course he's cool. It'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. You'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. Good that he's better than the many cosplayers out there. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. He's back to clock cosplayer level, sorry. Oh my god. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? No. More for me. He, he drank the ketchup bottle? Ew. And he's scratching his butt. Anyway, cool on you. I have to agree. Papyrus tries real hard. 
Mm -hmm. Kali keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. I would too. The next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, um, still a work in progress. That I can see. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. <laughs> yes, I've heard of Flowey. So you know all about it. The Echo Flower. Oh! Really? They're all over the marsh. Say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, Flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an Echo Flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. I thought he was talking about Flowey, that goddamn bastard. I really hope I get to kick Flowey's ass sometime. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? <laughs> Thanks you so much. It's just... I don't have that kind of money. Just kidding. Curl me put it on my tab. <laughs> Man, you're a joker. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Okay. Okay, I should probably continue onwards. And just walking. Okay, it says Library. That's one hell of a name. Ah, hey, Papyrus. So you came back to have a date with me. Yes! <laughs> Yes! This is gonna be awesome! You must be really serious about this. Mm hmm I'll have to take you someplace really special. Place I like to spend a lot of time. The library? No, not the library. My house! <laughs> awesome. Okay. What's with that room to the upper right there? Is it lava? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. That's awesome. Um, the kitchen. It's a dirty sock with series of notes on it. Sons, please pick up your sock. Okay, don't put it back down. Move it. Okay, you moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay, and don't bring it back. Okay, it's still here. What? Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. Ooh, what's on? Ooh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. <laughs> it's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yes! Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. Look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. Inside, stop. Yeah. I can see where this is going. Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. That's my room! If you're finished looking around, we can go in and... Do whatever people do when they date. Uh, nah, let's look around first. A classic image. It only reminds me of what's important in life. Bones. Door is locked. Okay, let's check out the kitchen before we go into Papyrus's room and do whatever people do on dates. Ahaha, uh -huh. interested in my food museum? Please, 
peruse my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. Why am I not surprised? The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. That's a trash can! Feel free to visit it anytime! Impressed? Increase the height of my sink! That's genius! Now I can fit more bones under it! Take a look, see! <laughs> Hi, doggy! Look at the bug I look on that poor doggy! What? Catch that meddling canine! Curses! <laughs> Songs! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a, a quiche, but filled with a sugary, non-egg substance. How absurd! There's an empty pie tin inside the stove. Okay, Papyrus, I guess we're gonna um, go to your room and uh, do the datey things. I'll just look at that look, just going, uh huh, yes, we're gonna go in there, yeah. Okay, let's go inside. <laughs> He's got a racing car bed! <laughs> what is this? Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. It was today. Even though it was basically just happened. <laughs> And does he have Pokemon figures or something? Ah, yes! Action figures! Great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah! That's right! Santa! <laughs> and that book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. And next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny! <laughs> the ending always gets me. <laughs> the internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double digit follower account! <laughs> He's got less followers than me. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy fun. I wonder who that could be. Let's... There are no skeletons inside my closet! Except me sometimes. Are you in the closet? <laughs> Look in the closet. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Okay, let's check out the racing bed. That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair! You don't have hair, you poor. Son of my skin! And of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. So, um, <laughs> if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? <laughs> Oh my god, this is so wrong. When I started this game, I never thought that it, it, it like would be a more hilarious dating thing than how to, how to full boyfriend or Hunipop or in those games. This is... Begin the date. Yes, let's begin the date. Okay! Dating start! This is a fight. Dating start! Here we are, on our date! I've actually never done this before. <laughs> but don't worry! You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. <laughs> Whoa, we have felt so informed! Crime population related. <laughs> yeah, this looks like the hunt for a dating game, all right. It's just. <laughs> I think we're ready for step two. Step two. Ask them on a date. Ahem. Human. I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. Yes. I'm oh. <laughs> Just look at the plush, isn't that adorable? Oh yes! Isn't it cute? 
I guess that means it's time for part three! Step three, put on the ice clothes to show you care! I'm waiting! Wait a second. Wear your clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today, you're also wearing clothing. No! Could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes? <gasps> Look at that silly face! No! You plan it all! You're way better at dating than I am! Yes, I am. No! Your dating power! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Don't think you're best at me yet! The tension! Mmm! Lots of tension during this date! I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. You just told me you you never dated before. <laughs> just... I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. Very impressive. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Cool dude, what do you think of my secret style? I'm tempted to say I hate it. Just, you know, for shits and giggles. Think of my secret style. Hey, I hate it. No! Your honesty! It shows how much you really care! <laughs> my date ball went even further up! Yes! However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This day won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. What's this secret? Move and inspect with C. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing art articles can be improved this way. Okay, kids, remember that. If you want your clothes to be cool, just write cool on them, and they'll be super mega awesome. Triple cool. My hat? My hat? My hat? Yeah! Well then, you found my secret! It's a gift! I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it. Spaghetti! You know what this is? Of course! Spaghetti! I knew it! The best gift ever! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But oh so wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask, and cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human! It's time to end this. There's no way this can go in any further. Reviews! You mean, you're letting me have it instead? Because you know how much I love pasta? Impossible! Taking my present and turning it around on me! <laughs> Arg! No! Dating pal through the roof! Oh yeah, human. It's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Yes, I am. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. Eh, uh, it's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I... Um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? <laughs> oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't, li don't like the way you like me. Romantically, I mean... I mean, I tried very hard to... I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But, uh, alas, I, the Great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. Instead, by dating you, we have only drawn you deeper. Into your intense love for me. <laughs> A dark person of passion, with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No! Wait! That's wrong! I can't fail at anything! Human, I'll help you through these trying times. Keep being your cool friend. 
and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. Mm -hmm. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. That's very observant. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. You're a good guy, Papyrus. <laughs> yeah! Oh, and if you ever, ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime, platonically. Well, gotta go! Yeah! Best date ever. Yes. That was... That was just awesome! I mean... The hell? Oh no, I didn't mean to go in there. Or maybe... I don't have enough to buy more health stuff. But I can save... Even though it would have been cool to have a separate save just to do the date thing again. Because that was hilarious beyond reason. So let's head back towards the Echo Flowers. And it's foggy, la la la. This game is really, really fun. It's the funnest game I've played all year, I think. This is a box. Yes, thank you. Oh, would you though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. Okay, I doubt I can pass through that way. I can't go there. And I should probably go down here so it doesn't, you know, knock me down. Swore I saw something behind that rushing water. So. Ah! Huh? There's a camera behind the waterfall. Why is there a camera here? I mean, it, like, was a camera. You know. Oh! I can go through here. Uh, so, is it. Something I get for noticing the cameras that been around outside of the ruins. I mean, it was a camera in the beginning. Man, that's some dramatic lightning. Or lighting. <gasps> Papyrus, what are you doing there? Uh, I, Undine, I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. Then I dated them. Fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Well, uh, no. I tried very hard on Dean, but in the end, it didn't really matter. I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But, Undine, you don't have to destroy them. You see, you see... I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Dun dun dun. <gasps> no! No, 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 no. Turn around. Bye bye. No, 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 no. Don't want. Don't want. Don't want. Yep, I'm holding still. Nobody here but, but, but us squirrels. That was kind of dramatic. Ah, oh, hello there! Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous! What did you do to get her attention? Haha, <laughs> come on! Let's go watch her beat up some bad guys! Oh, he tumbled! Poor thing! Okay, time to save. But she stayed determined. 
And I think that's a good stopping point for this part. But I'll take a quick break and then I'll stream some more because holy hell do I love this game. And, uh, and I'm uploading uh, these parts to uh, YouTube as I play. And uh, I hope that you'll continue watching. I'll, I'll be back in a little while. Just keep watching my streaming page. So thanks guys and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.